one of these two guys is going to Abu Dhabi. How excited are you? I'm really looking forward to the opportunity to uh, get in touch with the, uh, the Abu Dhabi fans. Um, I heard they're, they're just fanatics. Uh, I can't remember if this is the second or third fight they've had out there, or one in Dubai as well maybe, but um, I've heard a lot of good things from the wrestling community as well, and uh, mixed martial arts fans, so it's definitely going to be a, a lot of fun. Tatsuya Kawajiri, obviously a very well-known fighter to the hardcore fans, been around for a long time. This is almost, this is in essence two legends, one from the East and one from the West, meeting in Abu Dhabi. Is that one way that we can look at it? I think so. I would not consider myself a legend as of yet. You still got to win that strap, do something, you know what I mean? But I'm, I'm definitely taking on a legend in um, one of the former, I think years ago he was one of the, you know, might have been one of the top ranked guys. So. He's not going to become April 11th. I'm going to make sure he's just another guy in the 145 pound division. But uh, I've always looked up to him, always enjoyed his fighting style. And um, he's got a long, long list of, uh, of big wins and big names you know, on, his, uh, on his belt. At 155, when you guys were both competing at 155, did you ever think one day that you guys would cross paths? Um, at 145? Right. No, I, I never thought of 145. I figured if it was going to take place, it would have been a lightweight. But um, it'll be interesting to see how he handles his second, uh, his second weight cut. And, he won his debut, and that'll be the last time until he has another opponent after me. But um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna stop his uh, his chain of wins. What's I mean? You look at a guy like Tatsuya. He's also a very good wrestler. Obviously, a different type of wrestling uh, over in Japan than they have over here in the states. Is it just a matter of you know what? There's two wrestlers stepping in there. Let's see who breaks first. I think you could you could say that. that's a that's a way of looking at it. He's got um, very he's very strong. He possesses that um, that problem, and um, you know his grappling, his top game is very good. Uh, you know his grap his uh, jiu -jitsu, I'm sorry, his uh, ground and pound is all right, but he just kind of wants to he wants to grab you and squeeze you and crush you. Hence the nickname. Um, I'm kind of more of an explosive, you know, take downs, get back up, take him down, let, you know, beat him up, get, let him up, whatever. So um, yeah, a clash of wrestlers, I guess, would be a good uh, good description. If I can go back to the Mendes fight, lessons learned from that fight? Oh, stay off the fence, you know. We backed up, I came out very aggressive. Um, and that, you know, my, maybe my back was against the wall and not having the most uh, exciting past couple fights before that. And uh, I thought it was a pretty close fight. Chad was definitely winning, but um, he caught me up against the fence and uh, keep my back off the fence. I learned that. My brother told me that day one, you know, and I just kind of fell asleep behind the wheel for a second. Back to Kawajiri real quick. Um, a victory for Tatsuya obviously keeps your name relevant in the division but what do you think it means for you um just absolutely keeps us fresh and keeps us you know fighting the upper echelon in the 145 pound division that's where we want to be um put together a win streak and um keep working our way to my dream to you know to, to that belt it's just a matter of time before jose aldo has a, a, a tough opponent like I think with, without the long layoff that Ricardo Lamas had, I thought maybe that was the guy that could beat him. I think a uh, Chad Mendez or a Cub Swanson is going to be one of the guys to, to beat Jose Aldo. So it's just a matter of time before he gets a, a bad matchup again. And I, I believe it's just um, that belt, it, it, the 145-pound division is up for grabs right now.